you know when we were children and we would go to playgrounds there were always some kids who would be at the sidelines maybe because they looked different their clothes fits but they were all children and they all deserved access to a playground the fundamental thing is that if we start thinking about inclusion while we are designing then automatically these thoughts will come the typical taxi that you might call or the bus or the train that you might need to take is not wheelchair friendly for example and when we make all of this more inclusive it helps everyone the minority communities starting from people with disabilities to to the lgbtq community to even gender minorities women sometimes don't set, take center stage and they get missed out in the whole product design process a queer muslim woman might have a completely separate time scape when compared to a man who is probably from an upper class and caste and how he navigates the day versus how she navigates her day individuals feel extremely comfortable talking about their identity but more importantly the needs the nuanced needs that come with having that identity so we are inviting applications from uh, a very wide range of technology product companies in india uh, across different verticals fintech companies health tech companies grocery uh, delivery apps uh, gov tech companies edtech companies a program like the inclusive product management fellowship will enable uh, people in product management roles to a understand the specific needs of these various user groups and build products that cater specifically to these user needs while also making the business case for these companies i think the tech community and the tech ecosystem is longing to sort of solve for this uh, actively because it really enables so many user groups to uh, claim what is rightfully theirs which is essentially easy access to goods and services and our hope is that through this process we'll be able to create features that are more inclusive for marginalized users and actually positively change uh, the lives of at least 5 million users it's important that this technology be designed with the needs of the disabled in mind and it's from it's from that perspective that an intervention of this kind becomes extremely important as a team we need to acknowledge this and need to understand that we need perspectives of everyone while building in the prop and as a women also we need to learn how do we be equal stakeholders in this prop building or development cycle and how do we innovate through a feminine lens can we actually have tags and identifiers for services that are reliably queer friendly These services can range from queer friendly employers, restaurants, counselors, insurance, financial advisors, real estate agents, hotels, vacation planners and the list is honestly endless. This is exactly where inclusive product manager fellowship comes into the picture. Uh, it's a fellowship designed exclusively for product managers and designers to not just learn about building inclusive products but to actually go ahead and implement it. Uh, in reality and it's not just a fellowship uh, in the traditional sense it's a entirely different learning experience so i'm really excited by this fellowship and excited to see the impact it will create so that not just the women pms but all pms develop that gender lens and develop that inclusive lens 